Listen up, thugs for less. We got a big job ahead, so pay attention. Uh, Megacorp has hired us to protect their CEO, Mr. Fizzwidget. They feel that he is getting a little, uh, you know, cuckoo in his old age, and they're concerned for his safety. Now, Fizzwidget's kind of old-fashioned, so I want everything handled with the... <coughs> pride and courtesy people have come to expect from us. Also, be on the lookout for these two characters. I have a personal interest in seeing them rubbed out, so... I'm offering a free pizza party to the squad who bags them. And remember, that includes drinks and desserts. Over and out. What the? This isn't Fizz Widget. Would you like a free proto pet sample? Available today, old lord. Where is he? Freeze, knuckleheads! Oh, no. The two of yous are under arrest for attempting to bump off Mr. Fizz Widget. But this isn't... Save it, Fuzzy. You're not fooling anyone. You and your metal buddy just earned yourselves a trip to our new prison. <laughs> Watch this. Thugs for Less Prison would like to wish you a happy incarceration. After a poolside orientation, all new inmates will meet one-on-one -on -one with a galactic nutritionist. This professional will ensure that you're eating a species-appropriate diet for your entire stay. Next, come check out our fitness spa with your personal trainer. Remember, a prison term can feel twice as long if you're not in proper shape. And for those times when you're just feeling blue, come talk it out with one of our 10 full-time life coaches. They'll help you find your smile again. Thugs for Less Prison. Experience the maximum in security. <laughs> What'd you think of that? That didn't seem so bad. I assume you have provisions for vegetarians. Of course. Vegan or fruit. Wait a minute. You, take them away. And then pound their ship, too. I have thoroughly analyzed our surroundings, and I am afraid that there is absolutely no means of escape. Except that. Someone's got a girlfriend. <laughs> I will be right back. Don't uh, stop for anything along the way. Hey, check this out. Another wrench. <laughs> So, did you run into your little friend out there? I do not know what you mean. Ratchet, Clank, I hope this gets through to you. I'm transmitting from the Thugs for Less fleet. This ship just returned from a Megacorp distribution center. Hey, who's there? Meow. Oh, wait a minute. What are you doing here? <laughs> Sending a message to your little pals, huh? Well, say goodbye, boys. Take her to headquarters. Whoa! Did you see that? Yes, Angela knows how to defeat the protopet. And? And she does a terrible cat impression. And we have to rescue her from the thugs. Agreed. We need that answer. And we have to protect her. Okay. I will upload the coordinates. <laughs> I know those pants. And sarn it! Here's the problem. Excuse us, sir. 
What are you doing here, in this galaxy? I can't control where things break. I just fix them. Surely someone in this galaxy can... Shh! I know that, but they don't. I get triple time and travel expenses. Ew, what's that? Some dead burned fool flushed this perfectly good quark action figure. Sure, it's a little ripe, but look at that craftsmanship. You want to buy it? There you go, pal. See you in another year or so. What did he mean by that? Cool. Mwah. I'm taking the captain home before the humidity gets to him. I detect thugs for less ships at one o'clock. It's payback time. Well, it looks like the thugs moved Angela out of this quadrant. See if you can pick up any transmissions on the deep space channels. What is your problem? I'm trying to make a living here and you two losers keep lousing it up. Ratchet and Clank, isn't it? Yeah. Look, if you two don't hightail it back to your own galaxy, I'm gonna blast you into so many pieces you'll need a... Um, uh, well, there's gonna be a lot of them. I can tell you that. So you two hit the road, and don't bother trying to find me, cause I've got wind! Uh, I mean, I'm like the wind! You never know where I might show up next! And I blow hard! And I can be cooling on a warm summer day! And, uh, uh, well, you get the idea! Goodbye, morons! Does he realize he has just transmitted his exact location? If not, he's about to find out. <laughs> What's so funny? Uh, nothing, I guess. Uh, prepare to die! Phew. You okay, Clank? Great. Let's go. Hello? Aren't you forgetting someone? Oops. <laughs> oh, I meant, uh, after we free Angela. Thanks. Now, before you run off... Take a look at this. I picked it out of Lizard Boy's pocket. Log entry 4792. Returning from Megacorp's distribution center. I'm beginning to suspect that Megacorp has lied to me. The extra-large decorative paperweights being stored there might actually be an enormous supply of protopets. Which might explain why the whole facility is guarded by ravenous mutant creatures. Their warehouse ship may hold as many as 10 million crates, and with 100 protopets per crate, that could be as many as, um, if, uh, forget it, 3.5 zillion protopets. A secret shipment that large can only mean one thing Megacorp is up to no good. I will confront them as soon as possible and demand a bigger cut of the action. Are they insane? The galaxy is in far more danger than I had imagined. Do you suppose, Mr. Fizzwidget... We've wasted enough time on Fizzwidget already. I swear that crazy old man is not the same person I used to work for. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You used to work for Megacorp? Yes, in the genetics division. On the protopet? On fixing the protopet's flaws! And I was this close to succeeding when Fizzwidget suddenly pushed up the release date. <sighs> Is it worth disrupting the protopet shipments? It's a start. But to stop them for good, we're gonna need to break into Megacorp headquarters. Break in? How? I have an old Megacorp ID on my home planet. We'll split up then. Clank and I will go to the distribution facility. You go grab the ID. See if you can find any more news on the protopets. And now, Behind the Hero brings you the conclusion of our series on Captain Quark. As of this airing, the fugitive superhero has been missing for almost six weeks. Did he die heroically? Was he the victim of an overzealous fan? Or is he still out there somewhere? The galaxy may never know, but stay tuned for more baseless speculation and crackpot theories on Behind the Hero.
Incoming! Get down! What the? Hello! Ratchet and Clank. You lucky devils! Angela Cross... ...has just sent you a galactic greeting! Guys, if you get this message, please meet me on my home world. Just so you know, I found my old ID badge. I'm pretty sure we can still use it to infiltrate Megacorp HQ, but you're gonna have to hurry! Before the protopets completely overrun us! Oh, and uh, sorry for the balloonogram. It was the only thing I could get off this pl- We hope you enjoyed your galactic greeting! That Angela is quite resourceful. Yeah, she thinks of everything, doesn't she? She also appears to be in great danger. Go ahead. You'd be doing me a favor. So. Oh, sorry. It's just, I thought you were one of them. Oh, dear, dear. What I'd give for even an ounce of their feral ignorance. A burden often accompanies self-awareness, sir. Living with the abject savagery of one's own kith and kin is quite more than one can bear sometimes. No, the torment of it all. I understand. I, too, am of a series designed to destroy. Oh. In that case, I have something that may interest you. But may I first humbly request a meager few boats for food? Lovely long time since I've eaten. This is Darla Gratch, reporting live from Algon City, where protopet mania is in full swing. For those who've spent the past week in hypersleep, the protopet is Megacorp's wildly popular bioengineered pet. Adorable, non-allergenic, and housebroken, fans of the creature have dubbed it the perfect companion. Between the protopet's surprisingly low price tag and its lightning-fast breeding cycle, there may soon be more than enough protopets for everyone. Darla Gratch, Channel 64 News. The entire population of that planet will be devoured. Unless we get there in time. 